Go. Go. <laughs> we are live. Do not swear. Say, oh. <laughs> <laughs> You're full of beans today. Oh, well, I'm going to London on to later. So oh, straight oh, 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 duck. <laughs> oh, duck, we're going for a little. I'll object to London town. So we're in <laughs> London, then please come and say hi to me if you see me about. Um, yeah, that's exciting. Not as exciting as, you know, the launch that we've got today, which I'm super excited about. Um so can we see people coming through yes i can see all the comments when i go like that i'm looking at the actual comments so because when i do that i can see them when i do that i can't see them but when i do that i can so i'll be doing a lot of this won't i it's a little dance <laughs> you seem to only, for some reason only have youtube come oh no there we go we've got some facebook coming through as well that's it nah, that's better. i thought it was only youtube there for a re for some reason so, Adam, show your face. Show your face. Oh, do I have to? Yeah, show your face. I haven't face. had a shave. I, I haven't had a shave. I don't need a shave. You've not had a shave? Oh, well, I'm I starting have... to get that, that, that sort of Mexican goatee back. I had to send yeah. Dan my passport the other day, and he said look, I looked like a criminal. Yeah, well, I did. I had, I had a full-blown goatee at that point. I did see that picture. It was quite funny, actually. It was like, <laughs> yeah, I was like, you just needed a sombrero. We've only known each other for since I, I didn't have I had a goatee for years. Yeah. And when I got married, I think I got rid of it then. I can't yeah. remember. Did I have one when we first met? Oh, I can't I can't remember. I can't remember that far back. I can't, I can't remember that far back. I know you can remember crazy hair days when I used to have bit crazy hair. Yeah. I used to have crazy hair at one point. Um it was like I used to, so I, I I did this like Mohican kind of thing. It was back in my early twenties, and I had like red on one side and then blonde on the other side, but it just mushed into ginger at the top. <laughs> <laughs> like ombre, ombre. It is, yeah, it was ombre at the top. Exactly. Uh, yeah, I didn't know the word ombre then. Yes. Well. So today we are launching our autumn collection. I absolutely love these colours. They're obviously perfect for this time of year. They will take you through winter as well. Um, but yeah, they are absolutely beautiful. They're very autumnal. I'm just um, buffing some tips so I can show you the colours. We'll do some swatches. We'll do a bit of marbling as well. I've just come back from Ireland. I've been teaching in Ireland. Um, and it was absolutely amazing. It was so so much fun like the irish are they just don't care so i'm a bit good i didn't come on this one because it looked like you were having a right good laugh especially in the yeah. when you went out afterwards oh it was absolutely brilliant honestly the, the girls are just amazing they just you know zero f's given and i just love how they are lovely kind thoughtful really looked after me had a laugh Honest, it was absolutely amazing. Um, <laughs> so I've got all them buffed now. Let me just clean. Where, where's your next uh, course was at that I can come to abroad? I need well, to get out of the country, man. We've got we've got some that are pending. 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 So we've got. Um, I'm going to Spain in a couple of weeks. You can come come there and do some. Go to Spain. Spain. Good too. Good too. Right. But yeah, as, as yeah, we've got a lot of interest. Um, so we've got some that we're actually just organising at the minute. So all will be revealed. And if you ever want any education um, from myself, if you head to the Kirsty Meekin Academy, website you'll find it and if you're already on the Kirsty Meekin um you know the normal Kirsty Meekin website it's right down at the bottom isn't it yeah it's right down at the bottom there's a link there but you can always put Kirsty Meekin Academy anyway do you want me to show you these colours are you excited do you know what 
Vanessa's has actually kindly painted them on tips already, so I could I could show you all the tips, but I'll show you how they apply. So I'm just gonna I'm just gonna stall you a little bit and just lay these out. And I hope that the camera does them justice because they just oh absolutely gorgeous. I just love them. We've got people from all over the world here. Oh, brilliant. What, where, where's Reunion Island? I'm going to have to Google this. Oh, now. Puerto, Rico. Puerto Rico. Oh, Puerto Rico. Oh, Puerto Rico. I've been to Puerto Rico. It's very nice. Mm -hmm. Very nice it was. Oh, my God. Oh, look at them. Oh, my God. Just look at them. How gorgeous are they? Right, I want to show you up close and personal. And I'll tell you the names because that's really important because obviously if you want to get them, then you want, you want to know the names, don't you? So where is this? So this one, which is one of my faves. I absolutely, it's like a, kind of like a burnt bronze gold it's it's a bit like vanessa's hair slightly ginge <laughs> yeah and it's full of loads and loads of sparkle i absolutely love it i mean just look at that right oh damn right so i'll ap apply that to the nail so you can see how it applies when you get your bottles they all come in this packaging which has been designed to protect the bottles in transit it's got all your instructions and everything like that on there and it's, it's fully recyclable as well they are so everybody recyclable. knows recyclable is that even a word it is yeah recyclable recyclable and they get yeah. packed also in some some uh, dissolvable pink packing peanuts as well. Yes, dissolvable pink packing peanuts. I had some fun the other day with some peanuts. I know, we're going to send you some of our pink packing peanuts. I'm too. excited to get the pink ones, to be honest, because <laughs> obviously, you know, they will be like so much better because they're pink. <laughs> right, so this is packaging. If you haven't seen it before, we've got a ro rose gold um, handle. You've got your colour at the top, which you can also see from the side. So when they're on the shelf, you know what colour it is. This colour is called Fall. It's number 70. It's named very well for the yeah. first one to show, isn't it? It is. It is because you know, this is this is the Autumn Collection. Let me get my lamp ready as well. Hello to everybody. We've got somebody from Germany as well. That's amazing. Somebody just asked a quick question about the um, about the, the design on the bottle, um, just with regards to the skull. What is the reason behind the skull in your rose? Right, so I absolutely love skulls. A little bit obsessed with skulls. We have many skulls around the house. And they don't have to be just, you know, scary. Skulls can be pretty. Um, so the rose around it adds that delicateness to them. So, you know, you've got this dark skull with this beautiful rose. Um, so I've just wanted to incorporate things that I love. I love tattoos and ideally I will have this tattooed on me at some point. I heard you just got a new tattoo. I have just got a new tattoo. Oh, God, let me see if I can show you. Can you see? Yeah. So that is um, my cat Suki passed away about three, four weeks ago, and I've had his paw print, his ink paw print, tattooed, tattooed on me in memory. He's like with me forever. So yeah, I'm going to put the base coat on. So the base coat has a pink handle so you know the difference between the two and it's a shiny bottle 
I always put the base coat on because it gives you a smoother application and it also gives great adhesion. So I'm going to cure that for 30 seconds. I'm going to show you the colour, I just love it! So pigmented. And like with these colours, you can create so many different designs. This is, I know that this one is going to be popular because um, Ponyo is really popular. And Ponyo is a slightly different shade to this. So as you can see that Ponyo is a paler coral. This is more intense. This colour is. I'll come to that anyway. I just thought I'd tell you that while that was curing. Um, right, so fall. I'm going to do two coats of colour. I'm going to show you what it's like with one. Nice and thin. Can you see how thin that application is? I love how it colour shifts. It does. It's so nice. It's so, so nice. It's like got like a kind of a pinky base to it. Yeah, it does. And then sort of like as it hits an angle, you just get a boom. Yeah. Pop of the gold. Pop of the gold. Boom. Look at that. That's one coat. Thin. Beautiful application. And pop that in. Oh yeah, everybody loves the coral. They just do, don't they? Mm. I I did not know what coral was until I met you. <laughs> like, because you, you know, know I don't know. Was? Well, you you know that I'm absolutely rubbish when it comes to anything with regards to picking colours. Because you'll yeah. say, this is that colour. I'm like, I don't know what you're talking about. Like, what's a taupe? I have no idea what oh, a taupe is. Yeah, you didn't know what taupe you know, was. Or pretty much any other colour. It, it just confuses the life out of me. Do you just I know, know like, like the normal? I know the rainbow and that's about it. Yeah, yeah. So, second coat of colour. Nice and thin. It goes on so thin. Look at that. Beautiful. I just love the reflectiveness of it as well. What would that look like with 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 um, matte top coat on it? Because obviously it's got a shimmer in it. But what would it do? You, if feel, you, you see it a bit. I can do a bit of half and half if you want me to. Should we do a bit of half and half? So this is like, our like top pizza. coat. So the top coat is a rose gold, gorgeous bottle. That. I want earrings made from these bottles because they're just oh my God. That'll be really heavy. I know, or is it just but... so that you can just sort of unscrew and just touch your nails? <laughs> touch up your nails. <laughs> touch up your nails as you go. Oh, you know, that's a... And do you know what? Hanging on the Christmas tree. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Not a bad idea. It's a vibe. So, so the people have already asked, where can we get these things? On our website, www.kirstymeekin.com. There you are. Kirsty, not Christy. Yeah, Kirsty, K I R S T Y M E A K I N. So, top coated. So, I'm going to show you with the top with the normal top coat. And then, what I will do is I'll go sort of down halfway with the mat, just so you can see the difference between the two. So what he said there was the other day in the comment section, can you ombre a matte and a gloss? You know what? Why didn't we do that once? I don't know. I, I, yeah. We've done so much. We did do that once. Did we? What? what, what I don't happened? know what. I don't think that video's gone live. I know I've played around with it. Right. Because um, you can. It's never going to be completely seamless. Though. Yeah. It's just like I, I was trying to sort of figure it out in my head what it would come out like. But seem to compute. So our matte has a matte bottle but the logos and the writing and everything's all reflected yeah so you know it's matte it's got a pink lid and a matte bottle right so we want to come sort of clearly don't know how straight this is going to be 
but we'll see. I just want you to see what it looks like if it is matte on that side. So that is in the plan. You should do it. what we should do as well as show people, you know, when you with the um ah with the mini lamp. Yeah. What it looks like going from glass like glossy to matte. Because I always think that's dead cool to watch. Oh, it is dead cool to watch. It's so cool yeah, to watch. Mini lamp. Hold on. I left it. It's in my bag from Ireland. It's still in my little bag. <laughs> have you been away, have you? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Nice well, I've had to up. unpack and then repack to go to London as well, which, you know. Oh, you got away again, are you? You know what? Packing. Packing is something that I detest, like, so much. It's just. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I am just I literally just hoy a few things into a bag and just hope for the best that I've got the right things. So we've got the gloss on one side and then the matte oh it's like it's nice it's like a nice. velvet bronze isn't it i thought it would go something like that oh oh that's nice actually i like that <laughs> and my favorite is the gloss though mm. what do you think guys which is your favorite the glossy top coat or the matte top coat Yeah, I'm just trying to think what kind of things you could do with it as the mat. Oh, I've just missed my mum's comment. My mum commented. Oh, where's she at? She said she was replying to somebody, as she does a lot. Oh, she's very she good. She loves a bit of reply and does, does spam. Yeah. Right, so in, when I do my demo tips like this, I use this sticky tape, which is like a silicon, like a silicon tape. So I put it onto my little stand. I think the consensus is gloss. Yeah, gloss. Yeah, every, everyone's saying gloss. Gloss, yeah. I mean, there's still a lot. There is definitely a lot of um, matte in there. The matte, I mean, it is, it is nice. Mm. Right, so this one, next colour, we're going to do this one. What am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? Come on, kids. Right. Let's get this one out. I'll tell you the name. So that one was for and I've already been messing around with this one. I've even got ink on it, which I'm not very good. I'm such a messy, messy girl. This is now this this gel polish is actually named after somebody. And you'll find that a lot of our gel polishes are named after people. Now, if you go to the description, you will see an explanation of why they are called what they're called um now this one is named after a girl whose birthday it is um and i know that she can't join us today it's, it's the first time she's never been able to join us online she has done every single nail course that i have done i have like done whether it was online she's done in person she's even come to me and this is not like a stalker stalkerish uh, thing because we've actually built up quite a nice little friendship um she came to newkey when we were in newkey because she was on holiday down cornwall as well so we met up that was really nice and, and i built up quite a nice little friendship with this this girl we call her our most loyal client ever and she's been hinting Four months saying, oh, yeah, because you're going to call one after me, aren't you? You're going to like that. <laughs> you're going to call one of your gel polishes after me. Her name is Katie, and this is her gel polish. Oh, that's so nice. So it's a gorgeous orange. Nice and bright, just like the person. I'm not, I, to be fair, I'm not going to put base coat on every single one, just, but just to save on time, and you've already seen me do that. I know it will give a cleaner, smoother finish, but just for the demo purposes, and because this is a long nail, I like to go at the bottom first so I can <coughs> swipe through onto a wet layer to get an even application. So that is one coat. Katie! Bloody Katie Duck! So, yeah, do you know what? You, know, uh, you never know, there might be other names named after you know polishes called after 
other students that are loyal or people that I've built a, a friendship with over Instagram or online. I mean, I am running out of names. <laughs> <laughs> Just let you know that these are live on the website right now. Yeah, so they are live, so you can go over and you can add them to your basket. I mean, you can even add them to your basket and then wait till you see the colours. And then if you don't want certain ones, then you can always take them off. Or you might think... Why wouldn't they oh, want I... certain ones? I know, I know. But I, do I'm you know not. what I mean? There's no <laughs> pressure. I know they're gorgeous. They're pretty essential colours for autumn. Look at that. Gorgeous. So if you're doing pumpkin designs, Halloween designs, this orange is definitely the colour that you'll need. So that's you spilled something on that bottle there, Kirsty. I've just said I've been using it already. I've got ink on it already, and I've, oh, been, I've already been I've already been playing with them and doing designs too. <laughs> I'm a messy buggy. <clears throat> so this is our little mini lamp. So we can put a finger in and cure like that. And you want so you want to see me do matte. You want to see the map? Yeah, you? I just want to see what because you you can always see the the change and it, I think it looks really cool. It's but it's really hard to get a, and obviously the angle of it in the main lamp, even for me when we're filming. So when it's oh, it's flashing thirty seconds now. If you hold the button, mm. it'll go to five seconds. Hold it again, it'll go to ten. Hold the button again, it'll go to thirty. So that's how you set how long you want it on for. You can obviously manually do it like that as well. Somebody just asked, is Kirsty non-binary? Am I non-binary? <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> I'm definitely female and I'm definitely straight. <laughs> it was a very strange question. <laughs> very strange question. My daughter will tell you all about non-binary. Yeah, she knows yeah. her stuff, doesn't she? She knows her stuff. She does. She's in that community. So this is the top coat. Let's get that in the lamp. Yeah, just a couple of people are commenting that uh, the title of this video is wrong. It is because I was setting it up at the last second and uh, what, what's he still, say? still had the brush the brush collection on. So, yeah, this is for ah. thumbnail gel polishes. So I have changed it, but I think it's already gone live. One so. job. One job he had. One <sighs> I wish I only had one job, you know. One <laughs> job would just be amazing. Even if I could just do one at a time, but I have to do like three at a time generally. Mm. But yeah, so sorry about that, guys. It's actually the gel polish collection, and it's not a brush. We it's do. We'll autumn, have a brush one soon, though. Autumn gel polish collection. Autumn gel polish, yeah. So that's our oh, nice top coat on it. Do you want to see this with the mat as well? Yeah, but well, let's see that. That that. See if it chit like what. Well, just, what we can cool. do is. Let me get, let me just grab a something. Down, down, down. Talk about yourself. Ten hours later. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just a little serious. So, all my brushes, my millions of brushes. I'm going to use the um, Lily Liner brush. Oh, you're going to do a design. You're going to do something simple that, you know, everybody can recreate. If I can find the brush amongst the millions of brushes. Oh, somebody's just placed their order now, they said. Oh, fabulous. How cool. Do you know what? I just, I, lo I love the fact that we have so many supporters supporting us on our little new venture you know because this is something you know we're not we're not like this massive company we're a new company and i just love the support of my followers i tell you i really enjoyed it was when we went to um to professional beauty last weekend oh my we, god yeah we got to see people that we've got some vlogs coming guys so what i think the first one's going on monday um and 
yeah, we got to see who's the na- the faces behind some of the other brands that we yeah that we work with, with and yeah and, and um, yeah, I think we uh, we we'll met loads of followers. Yeah, you we met absolutely loads of followers, which was amazing. And I think as a little company, it's nice to see where we'll we'll go. Yeah, and be able to get there next year with a get massive stall. Yeah, we'd love to have a stall at these mm. shows. And then you can come and you can say hi, have photos, have some beautiful products. Right, so I've got some of the matte on my brush. And we're just going to pull in a little design. The matte um, is very, very light sensitive. Like even sensitive to normal light, as in fluorescent, artificial light. Anything that's kicking out a bit of UV. Yeah, because believe it or not, you know, your normal um, artificial lights will kick out some UV. You've got your phone on. Yeah, let me just see if we can... Yeah, you can see the shift. Somebody just asked, do you have to be a professional to buy? No, you can be a newbie. No. We cater for all. Um. There you go. That looks cool. It's got like a, some kind of, like a tiger thing to it, hasn't it? Is there? That looks mm. ace. I saw a tiger. Yes, no, not no, yesterday, the day before. We were at Flamingo. Oh, a real, a real one. Yeah, 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 a real one. Yeah, we were at Flamingo Land. Um, oh yeah, yeah. And they've got a tiger in there. It was quite big and scary. Yeah. Careful, don't bite your head off. So that is Katie with a little bit of um, matte top coat, a little bit of design. I, I love that. It's quite an easy, you know, it's just, they just shake your little lines so they're not too intense. Right, let me find this colour. This has got quite a lot of glitter in. And it's called Jaden. So this is named after my cousin, Jaden. They live in Wales. And they are how old? Oh, 14, I think. I think Jaden's 14 now, I think they are. So this has got loads of iridescent glitter and also gold glitter running through it so nice very beautiful so it's like a kind of like a burnt orange with a little hint of burgundy and um glitter i want to see how close i can go up with this can you see can you see it? Ooh, yeah, it's a nice image. Yeah, it's lovely. So I'm going to do two thin layers. Oh, I love this. I mean, that's one coat, yeah. Look. Oof. Right, pop that in the lamp and we'll go in with a second coat of that. Sorry, let me turn off. Turn off my... And then I'm just going to do a boomerang. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just going to do a boomerang. 
on on Instagram. <clears throat> Next, can you add the link to the to this on there? Yeah, done. Yeah, done. Oh, okay. Do it. Do it on that next one. Oh, you just be wrong. Oh, look, Nessie's on it. Nessie's already on it. I'm like, that, that's why she's my sister. Look, she's just there. Now. Pop your head round. Come on, Ness. Pop your head round. Oh, oh, <laughs> Look at Nessie's hair, isn't it gorgeous? It's oh, very, wow. Very autumnal. It certainly is. It's beautiful. Ready for open. <laughs> Both of us covered it. Ah, mm. I like that. Mm. Very nice. Mm. Very, very mm. nice. Thank Good you. Life. See, I don't even know what to do. I'm doing my ankles. <clears throat> Nessie's on the ball, man. She's on the ball. We've got a lot of people asking, are you going to be doing this kind of product? Are you do, going to be doing this kind of product? Are you going to be doing this kind of product? Go on. You know, um, we definitely have sort of plans to do lots of different kinds of products. Yeah. Um, and hopefully we'll be releasing new things as fast as possible. So like acrid gels, people have mentioned acrylics, yeah. brushes, yeah. Um, other just yeah. Everyone's just commenting about all different kinds of products. And we have got so much exciting stuff on the way. We really have, like proper, proper like cool stuff. <laughs> Will we ever see Fear's face? No, she doesn't have one. Ah! She doesn't have a face. So she is actually, if you really want to see Faye and you want to do a bit of stalking, she's not on social media because she just does, she just doesn't do it. She just hasn't got time for it or she's just not interested in it really. Even though she does sneak on her boyfriend's social media now and then. <laughs> have a little nose. Um, if you go onto my Instagram, so onto the Kirsty Meekin Instagram, <laughs> There are pictures of me with Faye. And you're going to have to do some proper CSI, like zooming in to see if you can see her nails and you'll know that it's her. <laughs> That'll keep you busy. <laughs> <laughs> so somebody's just asking about if we can ship to the US and somebody had said, no, we don't. Well, actually we do. Mm -hmm. Just there's certain products that we, we, we struggle with at the moment, which will be sorted very soon um but gel polishes yeah we can but gel polishes them. absolutely yeah we ship loads to america mm -hmm. yeah so that is that color i'm gonna hold it up quite high i'll go and see if it will focus so you can appreciate that iridescent and the gold so it looks more gold when you do that and it looks more iridescent when you do that it's very nice right okay so, now this one, this I would describe as, you know, this is like a raspberry kind of burgundy. So it's, a, it's not a true burgundy like this is really burgundy, this is. Whereas this is more like a raspberry. It's very beautiful on the skin. Can you see how flattering it is, the colour? It, it reminds me of a lipstick colour as well. So it's very, very wearable, aut autumn colour that's not too like out there. So, you know, if you go for, go to the coral, that's maybe a little bit bright for some people, but this color is mm. perfect for everybody in every skin tone. And I will tell you what it is called. So this one is called Claire. <clears throat> Notice the spelling of Claire, it's got no I. This is named after my auntie Claire, and this is how she spells Claire. Two, two different spellings. Mm -hmm. And do you know Jaden, the colour that I showed you before? Well, this is Jaden's mum. Mm -hmm. This is my mum's sister, my auntie Claire. And do you know what? I always forget that she's my auntie because she's more like my cousin because she's only like, I think, maybe four or five years older than me. 
um, similar age to my brother. And when we grew up, there was me, my brother and my Auntie Claire that were all similar ages. So we sort of, I say hang out, I annoyed them basically for all of their childhood um, because I was the younger one. So I just annoyed them. Um, I'm, I'm the youngest. You're not the youngest, but I'm in my I'm the youngest. I've got like two. Yeah, sisters I'm not them. the young. I'm definitely not the youngest. <clears throat> I've got a sister that's fifteen, same age as my own daughter. So it's like it's like it's all happening again, you know. Because <laughs> so my 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 daughters have got aunties that are the same age as them and a little bit older. Mm. Bad, <laughs> yeah. Dad's died again. <laughs> but, but you know what I mean. So did my mum because I've also got younger brothers as well, and I've got an older brother. But anyway, it's so confusing. Big family. So this one's named after my auntie Claire. She lives in Wales as well. She moved to Wales. I want to say <clears throat> she was. Well, I don't think she was quite in high school when they moved to Wales. But so they live in um, Rill, um, but they moved to Prestatyn. This is the most gorgeous colour. It's literally like lipstick. And it's so pigmented. I mean, look how dry I'm going with this. You can see how dry the brush is. I'm not like adding thickness, which means because you can apply it so thin, you get more from your bottle, more bang for your book, and it's thinner so it doesn't build bulk. Because you know that you can end up building a bit of bulk with gel polishes if they're like really thick. So we'll do two coats of that. And once I've showed you all the colours, I'm going to run through all the colours. We're going to do a bit of marbling as well because I just think, oh, they're just so bloody nice. We can pick a few colours that go together lovely for marbling. I just saw a question and I want to answer them. I can't find it. Where's it gone? They're coming so thick and fast. Can I get some of oh, this online? Right, somebody, I saw something about the purple brushes there. The, we've, um, we haven't, we, have we got, I think we've got a Cassidy brush and stuff. Yeah, we've got the Cassidy. We don't, everyone's asking about Alicia. Uh, the Alicia yeah. brush. We don't have the Alicia brush at the moment. Not at the moment. No, at the moment. It will be sorted soon. Um, will PayPal be an option soon? Yes, it will be. Very soon. So this is the second coat. Absolutely stunning colour. So that one is Claire. Please, I beg marble. Well, we've got Cheryl Walker on. Oh, it's a good job. Cheryl, so, Cheryl, what colours are people loving? Because, as everyone should know now, she's our official tester. Yeah, she's our she's our salon approved tester. So, <laughs> Cheryl is that lucky that she gets all the products to use in the salon and test them out. What? Yeah. What's 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 the favourite at the minute, Cheryl? <clears throat> I think she's going to say one that I... I think I, think I know what she's going to say. It's Here's another bad. question, actually, that people have been asking. What colour have you got on your nails, Kirsty? Oh, on my, on my nails? Mm. Right, I've got a colour on my nails that I can't show you because it's not launched yet. <laughs> oh, you mean you're withholding information? I'm withholding. <laughs> I am. <laughs> yeah, we've got some collections coming, folks, that are we sort of tested out stuff. So Kirsty always wears the tester stuff and we'll have them arriving soon. And as soon as we've got them, whoosh, they go out. That's it. That's it. As soon as they're here, we'll just So, this, I think this would look 
for a beautiful mat. So I'm just going to do half of a mat. Somebody's asking, what is the copper one called, please? I missed the beginning. The copper one is called Fall. It's Fall. You're doing uh, like a French there. Yeah, I was going to just do off and then I started playing. <laughs> thought, oh, just to uh, mess about with that a bit more. Right, so is Cheryl online? Are you there, Jock? Well, she's commented, so I assume yeah. so. My favorite. Well, she'll be right, commenting so. in between right, like so. each uh, each client she does. You know, like she does a client every three minutes. I know she does because she's super fast. It's absolutely ridiculous. <laughs> I mean, I, I think that she. Oh, she's flame. commented. She's commented. She's commented. She has flames coming off um, the nail file. <laughs> oh, look at that. Oh, that is nice, Matt, as well. Mm -hmm. That is nice, Matt. So that one is Claire. The next one I'm going to do is this beautiful bright coral. Now, Let me show you this one. So this one is named after a very, very important person who appears on our um, YouTube channel and is also the testing salon owner. <laughs> it's called Shazzy. <laughs> this one's called Shazzy after Cheryl, obviously. Now, Cheryl actually picked this to be named after her because she absolutely loves it. She was like, that is the one. That's got to be named after me because it's totally a favourite. So, yeah, this is Cheryl. So, it's well, Shezzy. Shezzy. Shezza. Shezza. So, let's have a look at Shezzy. She is beautiful and bright. I mean, I don't think that the... Um, camera does this justice it's like proper intense beautiful amazing with a tan absolutely gorgeous with a tan proper shows off a tan i should actually have this color on i think so that's one coat <coughs> that's one coat nice and thin let's pop it in i still can never get over how pigmented they are to be honest i know i really can't like that didn't look like one coat. Mm -hmm. A few people have said is the one named after Faye. Yeah, we've got one on named after Faye. It's, oh, where is it? That would come out in the first collection. Yeah. It is. Fussy this Faye. This one. It's called Fussy Faye. Surprise, surprise. And it's like a shimmery, pinky, rose goldy, like, do you know, like iPhone rose gold? That's what it's like. How gorgeous is that? So that's Fussy Faye. Obviously, she had to have one named after her. Because if, if she didn't, I think she would have killed us. So this is Shezzy. I mean, look at that with the second coat, though. I just want to get that on camera. How much more coverage do you get? Even wow. though it is super, super intense. This really intensifies it with the second coat. Somebody's asking if we have shipping to Mexico. Yes, and I'll deliver it as well because I need a holiday. <laughs> I'll go to Mexico. <laughs> I'll take a suitcase with me of, of gel polishes. Yeah. <laughs> just meet me by the pool in Cancun. Yeah, Done. by the pool. I'm just here selling gel polish. Am I going to be like the lucky lucky man? He will. Gel polish. The jelly jelly man. <laughs> the jelly jelly man. <laughs> Ness. Ness, I needed some kind of power. We're on 8%. 
Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Then. Oh dear. Oh dear. Mm. Unplugged, it's gonna break my neck on it. Oh, somebody's asking what brushes are being launched today. Unfortunately, no, and that was just me not changing the title of this stream. That was the last stream. I'm very sorry. It's New brushes coming autumn. soon. It's the autumn gel polish collection. EU shipping, we are trying desperately to get this sorted. So yeah, yeah. soon, 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 soon. Yes, we ship to the United States. Yes, we shipped to Tasmania. In fact, Dan sent something to Antarctica yesterday. No way. I'm not kidding you. We had it. What? We had an order from Antarctica. Antarctica. Are you kidding me? I'm not kidding you. I was that like, what? Ace. That's ace. That's top coat line. <laughs> Antarctica. Wow. Mars next. Mars. You'll Mars, have Elon yes, Musk. Mars. Elon yeah. Musk doing his nails. Yeah. Do you ship to Mars? Oh, yeah, we ship to Mars. Don't worry about that, Duck. Adam will just send his rocket up. <laughs> That's how we do. I've probably got one somewhere. Right, so I'm going to show you this burgundy. It has shimmer running through it, and I want to say the shimmer is slightly pink. It's gorgeous. Let's show you what it's all about. So this is called Becca. Now Becca is my cousin, also daughter of Auntie Claire. Can you see like a theme here? Can are they see? all a bit autumnal, are they? They must be. Now, so it's very rouge noir, but but big more burgundy, like more I wanna say because we have got one that's a very rouge noir, but which is vamp. But vamp is it is a different tone, plus this has the shimmy running through it as well, whereas Vamp doesn't. Somebody asking about Afterpay. Yes, coming soon. What's Afterpay? So people can pay after. Oh, I've never heard of that one. Is that yeah. like Kla Klarna? Klarna. Klarna. Yeah, it's like Klarna. 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 And somebody wants to see your light. You want, you want to see the lamp? The lamp. I'll show you the lamp. So we're going to do two coats of this. So this Somebody's is more of a purpley burgundy rather than a red wine bur burgundy. Does that make mm. sense? Somebody it said my head. it's burnt sienna chocolate. Burnt sienna chocolate. Oh, that's a good description, that is. That is a very good description. Yeah, I think, <laughs> I think I need you on board to do descriptions for me. <laughs> <laughs> that's, a, that's a whole job in itself. <laughs> so it's like, this is nice and thin. It kind of like, it feels very much like nail varnish. Well, a couple of people have asked, are you planning on doing any classes in the US? Yes, we are. Next year. Yeah. We've got to put it all together. Um, we'll be doing different states. Look at that colour. Look at that. Oh. Yeah, we should do summer in the US and then Aus Aus winter in Australia. Oh, then we'll just constantly have sun the whole summer time. Summer hot. <laughs> <laughs> Eternal summer. Somebody said sort of eggplant in a way. I think you mean aubergine. Aubergine, <laughs> it is, yes, it is very much like aubergine. It's a, sh it's a shimmery, shimmery, <laughs> glamorous aubergine. Yeah. Quick, change the description and put aubergine on the descriptions. <laughs> <laughs> wow, well, purple, somebody's put purple people eater. Purple people eater. <laughs> <laughs> I like that name. <laughs> Right, let's put the top coat on. I want it. Can you just see? Hold on. Come on, focus, 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 focus. focus. I want you to see the sparkle. It's so difficult to pick it up, but it's got that like pinkness to it. Can you see it there? It's so bloody nice. It's 
excuse the bloody but it's just this so has anybody got any of the Kirsty Mickey and Gel Polish colours already that's online I think there's a few right next colour after this one will be this which i love the name of this obviously i named it <laughs> <laughs> so this one is called beige dave <laughs> beige dave <laughs> so we say if somebody's a bit boring we call them a beige dave like oh it's a bit it's a bit of a beige dave though isn't it? you know what i mean plain jane beige dave oh he's a bit of a beige dave you know, he's a bit boring. However, this colour is so nice and can be teamed up with other colours to make it not boring at all. Right, so that is the, oh, the aubergine colour, which is Becca. So, here we go. Beige Dave. Beige Dave's not actually named after anybody in particular. But if you know a Beige Dave, you can say this is named after them. <laughs> so it's a it's 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 a nude but it's very beige i think uh kind of like a mannequin think of a mannequin and the color of a mannequin it's a mannequin nails i remember doing london fashion week with marion newman and we did mannequin nails they needed to look very mannequin and this is the kind of color that we used love it it's a perfect base for other things as well especially doing inks and all that somebody said could you use your phone lights just to show the shimmer oh maybe yeah 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 maybe that would yeah. show it up a bit so because it's quite a harsh light isn't it a phone light hold on let me get close oh perfect do you see it? Yeah. Look at that. Perfect. Top tip. Thank you very much for giving me that. So that one was Becky. I'll show you the um, the other ones as well. So we've got Jaden. Hold on. Let's focus. Please focus. Focus. Let's drop down a little bit and then back up there yeah so that's Jaden see all the sparkle and then we've got fall so this is half matte and half shiny oh yeah look at that that is beautiful what a good idea right where were we basically Beige Dave, that's one coat of Beige Dave. Great coverage again. And having like quite a pale nude on your nails is actually really popular at the minute. So this is the perfect colour for that as well. Let's pop that in. Oh, going a bit crazy. I just thought there we could have actually even called that one after me dad. We'll have to do another cream one after me dad. Oh, yeah. Cream oh. Cream oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. He's a bit of a beige Dave anyway, so you know. <laughs> right, let's top coat this. I think we should matte mat top coat this actually. Mm. I think matte would look lovely. Now, I find with any matte top coat, this is the best way to get the best performance is to wipe over, take away your sticky layer. Hold on. So I'm going to use the... Oh, oh, oh look, it's going... Oh, it's gone a bit delayed. Has it? My screen's gone delayed, yeah. Oh, well. You'll go up there. Yeah, it's all right here. Right, I'm going to take off a sticky layer. Yeah, it's gone. 
everything's dead delayed my end it looks weird <laughs> and like, i'm like am i in shot am i in shot oh no <laughs> <laughs> right so i'm taking off the sticky layer and we're going to completely mat this one very floaty floaty when you do the mat do it nice and quick don't forget it's super light sensitive let's get that into the lamp Someone has just mentioned, just said, not a single fuzzy on any of those nails, Kirsty. Well done. I know. Which is quite impressive because it's normally fuzzy central. It is normally fuzzy central. I'm just me adding. You know we're going to have all the fuzzies now, aren't we? <laughs> just going to prep two more nails. Just, I'm just buffing over. Buffing with, oh look, it's definitely delayed. There we are, with the 120 reusable buffers. So we've got our metal center board, and then I've got a buffer on top and the bottom, which come off, and are disposable, replaceable, and then the center board is reusable. So. Oh, somebody's just rubbing it in that they're on holiday. In Egypt. I was looking at going to Egypt for Christmas, but it's going to be too cold. Ugh. That is gorgeous, Matt. Oh, it is, isn't it? That is so nice, Matt. Because if you look, it, look. You to hold the gloss one up next to it as well. Yeah, it just sort of eats the light more, doesn't it? It does, and... yeah. I like it, Matt. I really like it, Matt, actually. It's super creamy, proper creme brulee. Creme, I can't say. Creme brulee. <laughs> creme brulee. Creme brulee. So that one is called Beige Dave. I'm going to move on to this one now, which is, it's got a sparkle in it. It's like a khaki. It is a different shade to our other one, which is called Andy. Andy is... I want to say, look, it's more green. This is more grey green. Does that make sense? But this has shimmer as well. Right. Okay. So, this one is called Eden. It's very earthy. In fact, it was a very earthy colour. And we'll get the... Um, the light on it as well so you can see that bit of shimmer it's a subtle shimmer this is a perfect color also to do nail art with because when you're creating autumnal nails if you want to do leaves and things like that then this is a nice color for that as well let's get that in the lamp we'll do two coats of that yes i got so many boxes <laughs> Sorry, somebody just put beige Dave in Matt looks like vampire's teeth Looks like what, vampire's teeth? Yeah, I think you've got too much Halloween in your brain uh. <laughs> <laughs> I can see that I suppose Well you could put a bit of um, Jessica Rabbit on the bottom of it like. Oh I've got a fuzzy Oh see what happens Oh my god sakes Luke Jinx me. Yeah. Jinx me. Never mind. I think you're all being a bit delayed now. Am I? Mmm. You still hate you're okay, though. Well, that's all right. I'll get that in the lamp. We'll top coat it, and then we'll get the, the phone light on it so you can see. Somebody just said, I've searched for fear, but she's not there because I have no idea what she looks like. She's on my Instagram. There's a picture of us. It's, there's a picture of us and it's very colourful. There are lots of flowers. There you are. There's a hint. It doesn't say who she is. It doesn't say who she is. You've got to zoom in and find her. Zoom in on the nails. And then you'll have to 
Now, is she ready to have proper you, nails? If you find it, if you think you find her on the Insta on the Instagram page, make sure that you comment and say, "Is this fake?" Mm -hmm. Right, I'll top coat this, and then I will show you the lamp as well after because um, people wanted to see the lamp. Oh. Oh, it looks like we've lost Kirsty for a sec there. Hello. <laughs> Let's see if I can get her back. Oh, and she's back. Yay! Sorry, we lost you there, love. Do you not stop being glued? It might do. Um, it might also be because it's not charged. <laughs> Are we all good? Looks like we're just having some internet issues at Kirsty's house, folks. Um, yes, this is what I look like. Hello there. It's nice to meet you all. Uh, looks like we're just having some technical issues at Kirsty's. I'm guessing because we're not together. I'm here in Hartlepool in my own office, and Kirsty's at her. Uh, place in Stoke on Trent so she may be having some internet issues um, I can't really do nails I can talk to you about the collection I suppose um, oh Kirsty's ringing in so let's hello hello <laughs> um, what's happened the, the laptop's gone off it did have, did have percentage on it but it's just gone off so your battery's and... died we are just getting it back up. Oh, battery okay. Died. Battery died, but it was plugged in. It was plugged in. Oh, that's yeah. not good. New new laptop time. <gasps> the new MacBooks yeah. new MacBooks have just been released, so I think it's time for us to get some new MacBooks. What do you think? Oh, well, they're a bit special. Oh. <laughs> very exciting. Very exciting. Um, I was just talking to people about. Well, I was going to tell them about um, the bundle that we've got. Yeah. Um, so this this collection comes with mat, base, and top coat. Um, and in the UK, that's $149.99. Um, and I don't know what that means uh, for other places. So just click on where you're from, and it'll give you a price, I assume. Yeah. And, uh, and also a um, – what's it called? Uh, shipping price to wherever oh. you're, you are. Um or you can buy them individually. You don't have to buy the full yeah, collection. Yeah, you can, yeah. You can buy them individually or you can buy the bundle. But, um, yeah, um, how much do they save, Adam, buying the full collection? Um, basically, you're getting a couple of bottles for free. Yeah. So, yeah, you're getting oh, it's 15%, just over 15%, actually. Oh, that's um, good. But, yeah, you're getting a, a nice little thing. Um, and um, we, we, we aren't doing it in a bundle with the lamp at the moment. Um, because obviously we've got the silver and we've got the bronze and we've also got the full shebang, which yeah, comes with lamps. Um, but um, it's one four nine for the bundle. People, just people asking there. Um, how, how are we doing? Are we are we are we nearly back on yet? No, not doing it. No. Oh, somebody's from. Oh, it's Paul Fortune from Peter Lee. It's one of my best mates. Is it? Why, why, Foggy? Why are you watching this? <laughs> hmm. We can't ship to the lamp to the US at the moment because of batteries. Yeah. Basically, crazy. there's an absolute um, next year. It's going to be pretty much like illegal to ship by air um, batteries. So we can do them through the um, through sea shipping. Um, actual shipping um but yeah it's uh it's not possible for us to do that at the moment we did have to send some people separate batteries from an american company oh that looks really creepy what are you doing there just be, just be silly <laughs> um got the, the computer's got the lightning bolt on it and it's got the battery thing like it's charging but it's doing something okay. like it um do you want to hook it up to the macbook the, the imac 
Could you do that? No, you can just literally plug it in, I think. We have another MacBook Pro, don't we? Well, MacBook. Yeah, there's another one there. Um, okay. um, you can't pick the colours with the silver bundle, unfortunately. It's it's the, the colours have already been chosen on that. Um, um, bum, bum, bum. I'm just having a look through the comments. Oh, somebody else lives in Hartlepool too. Hi, Glynis. Um, I'm not Italian. I'm not, no. My dad is Algerian. You do look a bit Italian, I think. Mm. Well, to be fair, like if I go to Mexico, people speak Spanish to me. Or if I go to Spain, in fact, and people speak Spanish to me. Yeah. Um, that skin tone, isn't it? I'm going to Spain in a couple of weeks. I'm so excited. I'm only going for the weekend. <laughs> and I'm only going to see my dad as well, which is probably not going to be that exciting. But just to actually get out on a plane. What was it like going on the plane to Ireland? Oh, wow. Can you send Vanessa the link? To this? Yes, I will do. Yeah, two seconds. Um, da, 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 da. So what was the flight like? Right, so when I got, I would, I've become really nervous once I got to the airport. Um, I was like, what is wrong with me, man? Why am I so nervous? Because you have to, you've got to have your COVID pass done. So those of you that haven't done your COVID passes before, you know, you need to get onto the NHS um, app, fill your details in and your link or download your, um, your COVID pass if you've got if you're fully vaccinated if you're not fully vaccinated then you need to do your lateral flow test thing which i, I wouldn't expect it might be easy i don't know what i did because i didn't have to do it because some people vaccinated um you also have to do a locator form so if you are um obviously traveling to a different country and you know where you're staying, so you stay in a hotel, or whatever, you have to fill in that country's locator form. So um, I did that. So because it's all done online, I still printed it out because I was still like a bit paranoid that they wouldn't, that they'd stop me from traveling. And I was teaching in Ireland and I couldn't let all these girls down, do you know what I mean? So, um, I, so I filled everything out and I made sure I printed it all up as well. Um, Got to the airport and um, queued up in the Ryanair, you know, queue. And they were asking everybody for their COVID passports and obviously the boarding passes and their um, passport. I was going to say driving licence, not driving licence, and the passport. So... When I got to the queue, she asked me for my passport. I gave her my passport and she went, Oh, God, can you see me? Oh, God, I watch all your videos. I watch your videos. And I was like, Oh, she was dead nice. She was so lovely. She was probably lovely. And me, my boarding pass wouldn't scan. So she basically did, did me another boarding pass. Didn't even wave me back and just put it on. <laughs> just put it on. She was dead out for She was lovely. But no, it, it, it kind of put me at ease straight away. Um, so, and then when you get to security, oh my God, the queue was ridiculous. And you know, you've got like remain social distance at all times. You have to wear a mask, obviously. Um, remain, to remain social distance. I don't know how that's even possible to, to remain social distance while you're in a airport security queue that's already rammed to bursting. It took that long. Oh, was it really? oh, 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 are we back? All right, okay. Are we back? Oh, hang on, is she back? Let's see. Does he need to invite me? Oh, no, we're there. You should oh, be, but the it's the reason it's I'm not coming up on the screen. Ah, there we go. Yay! Yes, we're back. <laughs> yeah, so I was saying once I um, sorry that we're just talking about general shit, like, um, <laughs> yeah, really. the filler. The queue for security was 
was busy and I thought oh, when I went on and checked in and online I thought I can't be bothered to um, do the fast track thing let me tell you on the way back I did the fast track thing and if you're going away do the fast track thing and the priority thing whatever it is if it's like it probably cost you another 20 quid tops do it because it's so it's so worth it um especially if you suffer with anxiety like i do it um on the way back it was an absolute breeze just walk through dead easy i could chill it was just lovely um because they did say to us they sent an email saying arrive three hours early for the i for the flight from dublin to to the uk and we were like what three hours you can understand if you're going to america or whatever but yeah it was yeah it was so it was it, it was stressful but i think it was all in my head more than anything yeah i stressed myself out as long as you you've got to really read those emails and everything that um that come through just to make sure you check everything off and you do everything but do you know what i would do it again i would do it again in a heartbeat it wasn't that bad i think just because it was my first experience i stressed myself out more than anything and it's yeah. stressful traveling by yourself as well. I, I mean, I do yeah. it quite a lot. And, and you know, I don't really get stressed at that many things. Mm -hmm. But that going different places by yourself and then obviously with the all the COVIDness. Yeah. Um, it's, yeah. It's, I'm not dead nervous, but just a little bit um, about what's going to happen when I go to Spain. I know I've got to fill in extra things. Oh, we have some gel polish there. I'm trying to get... There you are. Can you see that yeah. shimmer? I'm into it, yeah. It's nice, isn't it? So it's subtle. It's not like it's not like you know, like the um, fall one. The fall one is pure glittery, shimmery. Um, that's it. It's got a nice subtle shimmer. I love it. It's really, really nice. And green is really, really popular at the minute as well. So, last colour I'm going to show you is this one, which is called Sham. Now, Sham is my best friend's mum. So, those of you that follow me and know a lot about me will know that um, Izzy is my bestie. And Sham is a mum. And now Sham is a little bit like my second mum, to be honest. Uh, I feel like I have a counselling session every time I talk to her. <laughs> so, because it's it, she loves, like, these corally orange colours. So, I thought, we've got to name this colour after her. She's got a beautiful skin colour, very much like um, Adam's kind of skin tone. And it just looks absolutely stunning on her. So this is called Sham. It's look how bright that is, man. It's like whoa. Stunning. One coat, nice and thin. Oh no. Don't what? say we've lost her again. No, I'm here. Yeah. Alright, okay. Just sort of like went a bit grainy and Stopped. Oh no 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 no! Oh no! Oh no 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 no! God, I need some <laughs> loyal on my nails. Is there anybody from London that's on? What, what are you going to see, did you say? I'm going to see Wicked. Wicked. I read the book of that years ago. It was a bit pervy, to be honest. But a bit like the one you told me to go see. That was really pervy. Which one? Wicked. Wicked was the boss. I know, but if you read the book, it's got it's it's a bit naughty, like. Oh, dear. Yeah. A bit naughty. You're on about the, one, the, the Book of Mormon. Yeah. That one's awesome. Yeah, but a bit, awesome. a bit deep. Um, no, it's definitely not deep. It's by the people who make bloody South Park. It's definitely not deep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, somebody just said the book and the musical are different. From right. um, yeah, they're very different. 
So that's two coats of sham, beautiful colour. I'm going to get a nail ready to do some marbling. I've just covered in boxes. Covered in what? Boxes. I've got so many boxes. Where are my other chips from? Which? The long country one. The ones you've been using. Hmm? Yeah, the ones I've been using. The right then. Okay then. <laughs> Jesus. So what else are you going to do in London? Well, it's all about doing the crystal maze experience. Oh, yeah, you mentioned that, yeah. Yeah. And then I want to go do it well, I think. Shopping? Shopping, darling. We want to go shopping. We want to go to Camden. Anybody got any cool places in London that they think we should visit? Let me know. Let's pop that in. So this is two weekends in a row. Well, not week two. Well, two weekends in a row I've been away. So I was away yeah. working in London one time at Pro yeah. And then uh, I was in Ireland away. And then now I'm having some family time with the kids in London. Cool. And then I probably won't go get away again for six months. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just um, doing it all. Yeah, we've got to do some filming in between all of this. It's crazy. Well, yeah, we're going to do filming. But, yeah, yeah we've I mean, got to like, we go away, week. away. Yeah, we're filming next week, aren't we? Yeah. Yeah. So that is sham. Look how bright that is! It's just so nice. It's such a beautiful colour. Right. So let's prep some tips to do some marbling. Now, when you do marbling, you want to pick at least three colours, if not four, and you want to lay down your base colour to be your main colour and that will be one of the colours that you use. Does that make sense? So I think we should use Hi Virginie Oh, is that Virginie? Yeah, she just joined the stream. Hello. Oh, Virginie. Bonjour. Bonjour. Hit me up on my bell, Kirsty McKean. About as much um, French as I know. Je me parle, Kirsty McKean. I was trying to teach Isaac French this morning because he was watching something on the tip. I think he was watching a raid commercial in French. He's obsessed mm. with raid commercials and Mortine commercials, which is similar stuff. Mm, um, and he watches them in every language gone. And I was trying to teach him and he wasn't happy. What's Mortine? It's the same as raid. It's like kills bugs dead. Oh. Yeah. Right. I've got too many colour choices. I quite like this top one, not that you can see it. It's off camera. I'll show you. So we've got those colours together and those. Oh, I like Ooh. them. What do you think? Do we go for option one? Option two? Oh, hold on. Which is this one? Or option three for the marble? Should we wait and see if anybody comments? Yeah. One, two, or three. Should we show them the lamp while people comment? Yeah. So this is the lamp. I'm going to have to zoom out. Or I'll just show you on this camera. So this is the lamp. And I don't know if you can see. It's not very good on that lamp. Yeah, I'm going to show you on this one. It's pink. Mm. It's pink, not blue. Pink light. So it's got rose gold logos that are embedded under the surface. These are not, you cannot peck them off. They will not get damaged. Everything is laid inside. You have your power button. If you want, it's also um, portable. So it's portable as a lamp. <laughs> you can um, hold it like a handbag. 
Yeah. If you want to see what your charge is on, you're going to press this battery button and it'll show you. So this goes up to another one there. When it's fully charged, you get another two lines there. Okay. You've got a 99 second, which is 30 seconds of low heat, not heat, low intensity light. Um, and then another 30 seconds of medium and then another 30 seconds of full power. So you don't get heat spikes for those people using gel that they get heat spikes well, with. Go well, to the other camera because you can't really see what you're doing anymore. Oh, there. And then you've got a 60 second and 30 second, they both on full power. And yeah, it's a bit, it's a bit gorgeous. It's got a metal detachable reflective plate, which is really important. And it's metal both sides. This I've still left the um, protective wrapper on this. So when this side gets yucky and I can't clean it anymore, I can spin it over like that and have like a fresh, fresh side. So it always looks beautiful and clean. It is, um, it does activate by putting your hand in as well. Yeah, I don't know what else you can say. What, which one are we going for? What collection did anybody well, I think three won. Three did win. Right. I think so, yeah. So with the background, we're gonna we're gonna do the orangey colour, which is Katie. So we're gonna use Katie as the background colour. Which gives you overhead cam. Oh sorry, yeah. Right. <laughs> can't you can't you tell you're not you? Or not, yeah? <laughs> right, so And because this is really pigmented, I'm only going to use one coat because I'm going to marble and you won't see all of this colour. So if there are any parts that are slightly transparent, then those areas will be covered with marble anyway. Does that make sense? Right, let's get that in the lamp. This will be the last nail that I show you today because somebody's got their London. Um. I've got to watch. Well, I've, I've been watching loads of student horror films over the past couple of days, and I've got to zoom after this to like a panel to discuss them. All my days, there were some bad films. Was there some bad? What you got? Oh my god! Yeah, it reminded me of like when I was back at film school, yeah. and like how bad my films were. Are you being um, mean? Yeah, they were so bad. But at the time you think, oh, I'm, I'm doing so cool. I'm doing, I'm, doing, I'm doing really good. But yeah, you're not. You're going to give them constructive criticism? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> I am definitely going to give them constructive criticism. Not just criticism? <laughs> no, no, definitely not. <laughs> somebody just, Katie Murray just said, oh, my God, Adam, horror movies are my favourite. Well, I just finished shooting a horror movie last week, a feature film, so... Keep an eye out for that because we have got a crowdfund going at some point for it for the post production, and Kirsty did a wicked set of nails for it. So, I we'll that out. So I'm going to do lines of the colours, and where's my other one? This one is Claire. I bought this one. I think my mum should have this on next. And then we need base coat. I want a little bit of base coat between these colours. It's going to help them move. And we're also going to put a wet layer of base coat, nice and thin, onto this colour. Oh, we've got a fluffy. <laughs> it will help the product move and flow and you will get a better result. I'm going to use, not that one, the Fade brush, which is named after Faye, obviously. <laughs> so this is our ombre brush. It's nice and stiff at the base, but very feather-like at the tips. 
and I'm going to come across this way. So we're going to scoop. Then we're going to lay down colour like that. I can turn this over and add more, but that's the only other bit I'm going to do. I'm going to clean this brush before I do anything else because I'm going to go through again and scoop. We're going to scoop and then we can float float and can you see oh, can you see how it transfers from the brush to the nail and it does that because of those feathery like bristles pop that in give it a cure I'm gonna clean off my brush I'm also going to clean it off with a little bit of base coat so Bit of base coat. Boosh. If you've been using gel, clean it through with gel. And drag off the excess like that. Then put the lid back on. Really important to have lids on your brushes. Okay, so there's our little marble. What I want to do as well is just mm -hmm. add a little bit of shimmer from the fall colour. I'm going to use the Lily Liner for that. So the, I, that was a quick design, wasn't it, that? And I'm just going to add little bits of sparkle. And I don't like putting shimmers through the marble because they disperse too much and you don't get like a crisp line of the sparkly polish so that's why I prefer to add in afterwards like that. so cure that and then we're going to top coat we will double top coat reason we're going to double top coat is because when you are using gel polish as a medium for artwork it's going to be have a it's going to have an uneven surface and we want to make sure it's not uneven it's so, so quick when you do it that way isn't it it's so quick honest and it's down to the brush and it's the angle of some people get their brush and push through this way but when you do that and you put it transfer it onto the nail the lines run this way they don't transfer into the long line viney marble sweeps if that makes sense we'll do maybe we should do a full tutorial on this mm. in more depth and I can show you the difference between how you pick it up will make a difference. Right, so we're going to cure that. I'm sweating. Why have we got the heating on? <laughs> because it's nearly winter. It's ridiculously hot in here. I am <laughs> sweating. Wearing, like a whole tracksuit. Yes. I'm sweating. I, I don't want to be sweating. I don't like to perspire. <laughs> yeah. Is it sweater weather? Sweater weather. Right. Sweater so weather. I'm gonna get the buffer and I'm just gonna lightly go over. So this is what you can do to really smooth design. So even if you're doing like little pumpkins or flames or anything like that, then you can just whip over your top coat with your buffer. This is a 120 grit buffer, a 100 grit buffer would be way too coarse. You would just file through your design. Top coat. And that's going to smooth it out. And I can see a fluffy. Into the lamp we go! I 
them all on. <laughs> I can't put them all on. There they are. How gorgeous is that? Let me... Oh, wow. Look at that. That's like... That's actually probably one of the best marbles I've ever seen. Yeah. Like, I'm not lying. That is... And so quick. Yeah. So, so quick. And it is down to having the base coat on wet and also having a little bit of base coat between some of the colours. Only like two or three lines of it. Mm -hmm. But then the colours just really complement each other, don't they? Very autumnal. Beautiful. So there we are. So, like we said, you can buy the collection as a bundle all together. You can buy them individually. It's entirely up to you what you want to do. Um, but, yeah, I hope you've enjoyed this little live. Little live. I, I love doing these lives when we launch products because I can really show you in depth. It'd be good to refer back to as well. Or if you've got any friends that you think, oh, they want to see this colour live in action, then you can always refer them to this video because it will still be available. It'll be yeah. on YouTube and it will be on the Facebook, um, Facebook as well. well yeah. So, you know, if you think, oh, what was that colour like? Refer back to it, whiz through, you can have a little look and hopefully you're all going to absolutely love them. And I want to see what you can create with these colours. I want to see your work. Please tag us. Please hashtag us because we love looking at what you can create because some of the work that we've seen done with our gel polishes and our brushes is just absolutely There is. There's some absolutely fantastic and stuff being done. There's some amazing nail techs out there and you guys need to get your bums in competitions because you're doing so well. Honest, absolutely brilliant. So thank you so much for joining us. Happy shopping. I hope you all have a wonderful day. Keep an eye on my stories if you want to see what I get up to in London. I'm sure um, if you want to follow Adam as well, I'm sure he'll, he can do a vlog when you go to um, Spain. Yes, I am going to do a vlog. I'm, I need to get back into yeah. vlogging. I don't do it as much as I used to now. It's very so difficult. I, I try to, to do it. In Ireland, Adam, it's really difficult to do it without somebody yeah. there doing it for you. It is. It's, it's, it's a nightmare. Like, just trying, it's remembering to actually pick that camera up and do a little bit. But my dad is vlogging, right? Yeah. <laughs> I love his vlogs. They're so cheesy, but he's so much fun. So, my dad, um, he does some cookery stuff um, and, uh, and and he does travel stuff. He's traveled throughout Sp France and Spain. And very he's good, very good cook. He's doing yeah. really good, like learning to edit videos and all that kind of stuff. So, yeah. yeah, he's doing that. So if anybody wants to join him, I can't remember what it's called. It's a cream or travel and waffle or something on YouTube. Um, but, yeah, so I'll do some stuff. Um, and then we've got the vlogs coming out from Professional Beauty there yeah, next week. Yeah, look out for the vlogs for the on the YouTube channel from Professional Beauty. You might, yeah. you know, if you met me there, you might just see yourself on there as well because we filmed yeah. lots of our followers and everything. It was really good. Yeah, it was good. It was very loud, so we've had to play about with the sound and things like that, but yeah. It was very loud. That's what I was saying. I was, it's very loud in there. I just hope everything came out all right. Yeah, and then we've got... We're filming next week. How can week. I send you something you and a keyring, Adam? Um, I think my address is on the website. Like, this this office yeah. address is on, is on yeah, our the, website. Linda, if you go on to the website, you'll see the returns address and things like that. So you can send yeah, it yeah, it definitely is. And if you want on... to send me anything, you can send it to me there. So. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, open um, free, I'm open to free gifts. <laughs> yeah. uh, you can go onto the website. Everything's available right now. Um. Like it's 149.99 for the the collect, full collection with yeah um, base top and mat, or you can buy them all individually. Um, and we're going to be having more and more and more products coming out very soon. Um, How gorgeous the colours are! Um, Ashley asked what fake tan I use. I've got um, fake base on at the minute, and I used the old brush. It's a tan brush that we got from Pro Beauty as well. Mm. so yeah happy shopping yeah enjoy um, we love you all i hope you've enjoyed it um 
is everything going to be in the description box? <laughs> I don't know. I don't do that stuff anymore. Everyone used to know me in the description yeah, I do box. do it. Don't all forget to look at our Facebook and Instagram and all that shebang. And we've got, yeah, all that shit downstairs. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now get yourself to London. Go on. Right. I'm going now because I'm going to London. I don't want to miss my train. Thank you for joining us. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> See you later, guys. Bye. Bye. -bye.